Whoa, oh. Well, hello there. Welcome back to Stray. We just got the final notebook. And now, I don't know. We found the four outsiders' notebooks. And a note on how to fix the transceiver. Let's bring that back to Bobo up in the building with the orange neon. Okay. Um, with the orange neon. Okay, 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 okay. Yep. <laughs> this way. Sorry. Swanito, how are you? Those circles of light. Oh, I think I... That's... that's it. Yo! Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, I did the thing with the bucket of paint. <laughs> I love the weather right now. <laughs> What if I show you this one? If I would talk to Momo about this, okay. Sorry about that box. Cat, are you still looking for useless notebooks? Guess what? I found them. She was really brave, you know. The most fearless person I have ever met. Uh, the doc? Oh, it belonged to Doc. He was a really huge nerd for electronics and stuff. He was always on the verge of a great discovery. The bullets are yeah. This we go. This we go. <laughs> Wait, you actually found all my friends' notebooks? Oh, what's that note? The transceiver can be repaired. This is incredible. That means we should be able to communicate outside of the slums. Clementine's Baltazar, Doc. I'm sorry, I doubted our cause. I'll promise you, I will find a way to reach the surface. Thank you, we might be able to find you a way up. Oh, thanks, Momo. Now let's fix this piece of junk transceiver. Is the transceiver just the, um, the TV? Oh no, it's that. Okay. <laughs> and voila! It works! Come with me, and you'll see a world of pure imagination. Up there, see that building high above the others? If you install the transceiver at the very top of that tower, we should be able to communicate with the whole city. My friends might still be out there. If there's a way out, they'll know it. How are we gonna carry this transceiver, eh? You're the only one small and quick enough to evade the Zerks. We need you, little outsider. Bring us to the sky. To infinity and man. Uh, so that's our name, Little Outsider. Mm -hmm. Let's try the bucket. Wait! This is where the tough starts. The tough stuff starts. This is the cutest mode of transportation anyone has ever thought of. Wonder if there's a game where you're just a baby. Rooftops. Okay. Oh, we gotta bring it to that tower covered in a, a building. Covered in tarp? Sure. It's just scratchy, scratchy first. Oh no, you see the Garapatas there? Oh. Uh, 
Shout out Tex Fernandez <laughs> and his wonderful Garapata art. I don't know what to do here. Meow to attract enemies. Okay. Let's come out the wall. I guess. Oh, I guess. Hey, <laughs> can't catch me. You will never infect me. I need to get higher. I need to get my bearings cuz okay memory the city is full of neon but it wasn't always this way there used to be strict energy caps especially the slubs but people couldn't handle the constant darkness one day someone lit up a rainbow lamp neon signs all over their house that person was taken away and never seen again. But people saw hope, and not long after, everyone started putting lots of lights in their homes. There was nothing the oppressors could do. It was a way for the people to see colors again, like on the outside. I think it helped. What if we don't recover all of your memories, B12? Are we gonna get a bad ending? I don't want that. Oh, oh, it moves. Oh, it moves. Cool. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Okay. One, we're on the right, right path. Cool. And we gotta move this to there. Awesome, we're getting near the meat. <laughs> the the meat of the city. Seems like so they never finished construction here. I wonder why. Oh, oh oopsie. Okay. Um Babes, if I hack this door, it'll open, yeah? Awesome, okay. <laughs> and then I'll push you to that side. Nothing to see here, just a barrel rolling. On the floor. So far, so good on the um, Zerks puzzles. A B S C B N. <laughs> um. Okay, just a kitty cat. We're just a kitty cat trying to go home. And we ended up with a greater purpose, helping the robots see the outside. 
Oh, this meat, this meat is gross. Good job, buddy. Let's go. Oh, wow. Guessing we gotta get to there. Uh, but what? They don't see us yet. Maybe if we just move quietly in between these crates. Yeah. Oh no! Did they hear? No oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Haha, -ha, we made it. <sighs> I don't like that. It, our screen became super red for a moment. I wish there was a way to like to, to just defeat you. Cat with a gun. Neko Corporation. They were responsible for waste management. As trash from the upper levels overloaded the slums, they tried to develop a bacteria to dissolve it all. After the humans disappeared, that bacteria mutated, growing, eating away more than trash. And now we have Zerks. Let's go. Oh, okay. So... You guys were supposed to be in charge of um, pollution, littering, and whatnot. I think that. Can we get up here? We cannot. So, how? I see. You gotta run. You gotta run. Hack the door. Oh yeah. No. I'm not supposed to hack the door. <laughs> Too near. Okay. I love that the little LCD in our backpack. Um, it's like this is a time for puzzle solving. <laughs> Okay. 
I feel like it glitched. Let's try that again. How are you doing today? What are you up to? Okay, we hacked this. Oh no! Oh no! I made a grave mistake! Are you throwing stuff at me? Oh no, oh no, there's so many in here! Did they multiply? Yeah. Okay, let's do that again. I think it's just uh we gotta do it before they come. Good job. Good job, kitty. Oh, but there are more zerks over there. Come here. Can't jump this high. Can ya? Meat Tower. Trying to restore a transceiver. Oh my god. Okay, come here. And we go. This is just like a survive until... Come in though! Is it down? Is it down? It's down. Get off me! Oh gosh! Ooh. Come on, Beetle! Really are garapatas. We're safe. Kitty cat is safe. That's what the chair is for. Here it is! Put the transceiver on this antenna. I don't know how we did that as a cat. And did the robot also digitize it? I guess that's what, that's what happens. Oh yeah, communication established, motherfucker. Capamilia is back.
Look, the view is beautiful from here. I remember now. The city, it was meant to be a shelter. A shelter? Those look like stars, but they're only lights marking the hermetic roof ceiling off the city. Huh? Oh, so... Oh, right. We don't have an outside. Right, right, right. Humankind built the shell to protect themselves from the outside. But it came at a cost. Nobody could go out. The outside was a disaster. Completely barren, unlivable, and dangerous. It's dangerous? But if you come from there, it must mean it's safe again. And my promise wasn't just to go to the outside, it was to open the city. You remember B12. Vitamin B12. I still don't understand why some memories are coming back and others aren't. But I'm certain now that this is my purpose. I have to open the city. Come on, let's go and find Momo. Now that we've connected the transmitter, we should be able to get help. You be transceiver. Okay, those are main memories and then baby memories. Maybe if we get the main memories, that should be good. <laughs> I love it! I love it! The story is also pretty interesting, actually. It's keeping me engaged. Like, what happened? What happened? How do we fix it? Um, as a cat, how do we fix it? And as a cat, why do we care? This is Momo. Yeah? Momo! Look, a note! Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Call beep me there. I've locked the window, but the code is open. Is what? Is it what? I couldn't read that. Wow, admin, admin. Okay, got you. <laughs> Yolo, Ami lol. <laughs> be careful, as it is case sensitive. See you at the bar. That must be the code for the window near the entrance. Let's go! The code near the entrance? I don't want to wear that bag anymore. <laughs> um, oh, this entrance. Here's the lock for the window. The code was... There was an H. <laughs> Oh wow, that's pretty cool. It worked! Bobo is at the bar waiting for us. Good job, B12. Also, are you called B12 like vitamin B12? I, I meant it as a joke, but then maybe like B12. No, vitamin D is the sun. Hmm. Anyway. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I want to check out that um that thing. My friend and I love tossing buckets at each other. Good, clean, fun. So go. <laughs> Our downstairs neighbor disagrees. So we're taking a break right now. Okay. Um Sorry. I just... I haven't met you. I'm cleaning the porch of my shop. Again! Stop playing over my shop, you clumsy rascal. Gosh. Your arthritis must be acting up if you have to clean it every day. They have little balls for us to play with. Oh, it's not moving. It's a washer machine. Laundry shop. Everything. Every day. All at once. <laughs> Hi. 
that guy is cleaning the paint again. Make sure is making what? Sure is making use of all that detergent. Zoe, that's cute. Surgery. Goodbye, surgery. Where do we have to go again? The bar, okay. Can you translate? Barter man, super spirit laundry, grandma clothing, alien programming. Oh, the bar was near grandma clothing. Oh, this is the bar. Hi! Oh, there you are! Hey, little furball! Come here, I managed to get a signal. Uh, sorry, I'm so sorry for my friend. Yo, oh, we got pets! Let me see if I can get this thing working. I've almost got it. I got it. Hello, can anyone hear me? Hello, yes, we can hear you. We're from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you, Spaltasaur? Momo? Peaches. Uh, I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Spaltasaur. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes, Peaches. We are safe, Peaches. We found our way up, Peaches. Hello? Do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Peaches, very dangerous. Peaches, zerks everywhere. Sewer? How? Hello? Darn it, we've lost the signal. I can't believe it. This Balthazar is alive. He and the other outsiders managed to go up through the sewers? The sewer is the most dangerous place in the slums, but if Balthazar made it, there must be a way. I come from the sewers, that's where I fell. Anyway. What's up? Oh hey Gen Z. Seamus. You'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with zerks. They'll make you quick meal out of you, especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past, it doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you. Your business. None of my business. Okay, well, stick to your fucking bucket hat. Mubuff. Seamus. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. Oh, sorry, I was making fun of him and then his dad got lost, Bella. See, you just never know what a person is going through, so don't be judgy like me. Don't listen to Seamus. He's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue in Seamus' apartment. Come on, follow me. I like your shirt dress. Polo shirt dress, long sleeved thing. Yes, we are walking. Yes. Good, good, good luck, Cosma. I'm sorry. That was my fault. I'm sorry. Oh, uh, that's right. I am looking for sheet music to play the guitar to to add some ambiance. If you fly, Daddy, bring them back to me. I live near the elevator. Boruska. Okay. Where is the other one? Come on! Nope, that's not Momo. Come on, Seamus, open the door. You know, your father would have wanted to help us. Oh, 
Well, that was to be expected. This situation is pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me, but you? I think I have an idea. Your butt is coming out. Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. It contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an electroshock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try to establish re-establish communication with the others. This this scarecrow walking robot. What do you want? Okay, before we do this, I want to find the one that needs the sheet music. Since we've collected quite a lot. He lives near the elevator. Is this the elevator? It is, right? Hi, have I have we met? Joxy? Look at all the great stuff that falls into our trash. So many treasures. I love your face. It's different. It's smaller. You should go visit the barter man. There's something for everyone over there. Show. I don't play an instrument, sorry. Oh, I was hoping you could tell me where the musician lives. Are you here? Oh, yes! Nice. Meet. I love your face, too. Hello, I'm a musician, but I don't have any songs. Oh. Um, here you go. Petit va? <laughs> I don't even pretend to know how to <laughs> pronounce that. Petty vals. Here. Watch that. So cute. Hopefully it isn't copyrighted again. Love that. Good morning world. Hey buddy, I have more sheet music. How do I uh Oh no, it's a paper bog. Oh no. I give you more. Well, guess what, bitch? I got you, bitch! Cool down. I vibe with this. Why do I feel like it's a real song? It's, it's going to be copyrighted. I will never get to monetize anything, will I?
mildly important information. <laughs> oh. This one was composed by a renowned algo rhythm. Okay, let's see what the algo's got. Okay, it's sleepy, it's sweet. Oh, that was a short one, too. Okay. Well, good luck with that, Morsuke. I'll look for more sheet music for you. Ooh. A safe. What? Examine. Show B12. Follows the numbers but looks like a binary language, a succession of zeros and ones. It's written, follows the numbers. We must be able to decipher this code in one way or another. It's probably related to this safe. We have to decipher the note, which is a series of binary numbers. Access to the sewers is condemned because of the proliferation of Zerks. Stay safe, stay in the safe zone. Is this the entrance to the sewers? Got it. Okay, well, let's look for the, the apartment first. Hello. Ooh, what's this place? Azuz, hello, I'm the merchant of the market. You give me something, I'll give you something in exchange. It's as simple as that. This is an ancient relic, a testament to the talent of our ancestors. It will cost you three energy drink cans. I can't do less. I only have one. This is a set of electric cable, the best of the market. I'll exchange this for a super spirit detergent. That's the best I can do. I can get you one of those. Ooh. One energy drink can. Um, maybe not yet. Okay, 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 okay. Lido, we're fortunate to have these items to help us defend against the Zerks. The slums has it, it's that the preparation is key. Can I talk to you? Nope. Okay, um, let's head to the laundromat and try to get the detergent. Cause, uh, I don't memorize the layout yet quite yet so let's give some love in i love you you too <laughs> they love me love me love me say that you love me okay Oh, that's the bar. Um, hi, I'm here to get some detergent. Oh shit, sorry. There's the super, super detergent. And then we can give it to the thingy. The person? 
The merchant? Nope. This way? Nope. <laughs> this way. I think it was this one. The cables. Well, looky here. And then we can head to Mama Lo Clothing. Oh no, where is she at? No idea. Hi, that's Momo. Grandma clothing must be here. Oh, hi. Rosie. So if today is yesterday's tomorrow, tomorrow will be yesterday. Today. Right? Time is weird. Time is a weird soup. You know? Ashley Johnson 2022. We don't age like our soft one ancestors. Soft one ancestors. <laughs> <laughs> so you and me, we're soft ones. Here you go, Grandma. Give me, give me some loving. Yes, I do. Oh my God! 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 We're gonna get a poncho. <gasps> Thank you, Grandma. So, Pancho. This looks really warm. Perfect for a cold robot. Oh, okay. It's not for me. Hi, guys. Maybe that, um... Is there a homeless robot? I feel like y'all are all homeless. Just kidding. No, 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 no. That's not true. Oh, you? You, 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 you. You seem like... Oh, I want... I want to help a homeless robot. I'm so... I'm sorry. That's Momo. <laughs> Are they maybe up on the roof? Mm. Let's see. Love it, love it. I love it, love it, love it. Uh oh. But why would they be on the rooftop? Well, they are homeless. Maybe they aren't even homeless. What if they just feel cold? I'm sorry. For instantly assuming if you need a poncho, you are homeless. Ah! Swanito, where'd you go? Swanito. Swanito. Swanito, my friend. You, are you cold? Do you need a poncho? <laughs> okay, well... We tried. Maybe here? Ooh, energy drink. Ooh. Nice. Where'd you pop out, B12? Um, 
the vending machine by the elevator I did not push so let's go do that you're blocking you're blocking a vending machine to this one it's not working tell you what's up oh it's empty oh no okay to get more energy drinks and find out what the mysterious thing was also the sheet music uh, maybe we can just get the sheet music you know that's fine hi hi guys get the sheet music make one robot happy here you go. Thank you. I'm coming. We're gonna get some more jams. Here you go. The way you compute tonight. <laughs> okay, this is more goofy, more silly. Thanks for that, Moruske. Moruske? Morusk. Just texting. I'm so sorry. Hold on. Alright. Thanks. I'll go find more sheet music for you. Uh, I'm gonna go back to Momo now. Get this thing going. That's not where we went. I have to go inside and talk to uh Seamus. Oh. Sup bucket hat. What are you doing in here? I told you you got to do so so sad. Leave, leave me a bee. Um. Oh, sorry. Here. Show item. This is my papa's? Oh, wow. I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat? But where? Yeah, bitch. Maybe you should, uh, see what I have to say before, before you shoo me. Oh, there we go. Time will tell. Okay. Time. Time will tell. Oh, you're here. Oh, there we go. Two... Two five one two. I guess we're gonna just this. Yep. Even though we already found the clue, cause we're a cat. Oh, there we go. Two five one two. Oh, why does it go up to sixteen? What? 
Do five, one. One, sorry, do five. One, one. Well, look at that. Secret lab with Zerk's stuffed. I've never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. Well, maybe because... These blueprints. They must be for his Zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive with his work. He told me the weapon was working in theory, but it needed a real-life test. He went outside the slums and never came back. Robot news headlines. Zerk are officially no longer under control. They now eat meadow. Oh, that's why y'all are so scared. I just put two and two together. That's why you're scared. Um. Why did we do that? Are we looking for the weapon? Sorry. Probably are. Defluxer blueprint. Oh, what's that say? Concept. Light based hand handgun. Texting again, I'm sorry. Low priority visual appearance size decibel emitted. High priority test in real condition. Objective 20 Zerk destroyed per second. Okay, that's nice. Oh, where is it? Lovely. Cute sounds, but never friendly. Old bacteria of human time eat all kinds of materials. Total vision in the dark. React to the intense light. Okay. Oh, we are looking for it. Okay. Hmm. We already went up there. Or maybe it just didn't come out the box. Right. Nope. Nope. Aha, uh -huh, I see. This one? There we go. What is this? Yep. Yeah. yeah, I found this thing. Papa always used that tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it to find where he went. I can't believe my papa might still be alive. I've missed him so much. You need a weapon for the Zerks, right? My papa definitely took one with him. We just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. Someone in the slums should be able to help. Come with me, I'll open the door for you. Wow, now you're so helpful now that we're useful, huh? Well, you're just sad, because you don't have your papa. Papa, can you hear me? Thank you. Momo is gone. Oh, uh, maybe you went back to the bar? Mark. Yeah. Momo. 
This one. We are at the bar, okay. Um Jacob. <laughs> okay. Elliot, he's he's his office just left of here near grandma's shop. Okay. Uh we've been there before. No, I don't want anything from you. That one? Nope. This one. you yet there we go oh this is Nestor <laughs> sorry this Elliot ooh sheet music love ooh, we were programmed to be slaves but since 25 44 87 5 5 5 6 days what is that it's a trillion days? I don't know. We have a soul. Hope one day the outsiders will find the exit of this hell. Okay, Momo used to live here or something? Oh, that shift from red to blue fucked with my eyes. Hold on. Whew. Ooh, remember. Trees and toilets. This tree is a scientific marvel. It's remarkable that human ingenuity found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them anyway. It's what the humans would have wanted. So are you robots like us? Should I talk to Elliot or should I? No, oh, I wanna fuck with this. Sketch, 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 sketch. Aha, it's an exit. Are you okay? You seem to be shaken. Oh, sorry, I forgot to show you this one. Oh wow, that's a great tracker. I recognize this model. It's a Tohima BR2000. You can track anyone with this little gadget. May I? I know how to repair it, but when I'm trembling like this, I can't use my keyboard. I don't know if I'm sick or something, but I definitely don't feel right. It can't work when I'm shivering like this. I think I need a blanket to be able to fix your tracker. Well, guess what? We got you a poncho made by the best poncho maker in town. Where did you find this? It's amazing. Thank god we got that in advance. <laughs> Look! No tremors. I'm able to work again. Thanks, now I can definitely fix your tracker. Let me take a look. Just gotta give it an update and one more thing. Voila! Voila! There you go, little one. Good luck finding who you are looking for. Thank you, Elliot. Let me just leave my mark. Uh, my allergies are acting up. Is it because I'm, I'm playing as a cat? And maybe I'm allergic to cat? I don't know. Hey! No, we go out. Uh, now we go back to... Do we go back to Momo or do we go back to Seamus? Oh, I 
guess it's Seamus then. We go here. Oh, I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry! I didn't mean it. Dear. I did. Uh, I keep forgetting this to do this. Give me a treat. I'm about to find your dad. Give me a treat. We got a ping. Is Papa really alive? I can't believe it. Let's follow the tracker. Maybe we'll find where my papa went. How old are you? We used to call him Papa. <laughs> papa. 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 Where are you at, Doc? Jason. Jason. Sure. Sorry, Cosma. Also, maybe you weren't an effective cleaner who makes you need that for forever. This door. Ooh. This must be it. He really left the slums. It's dangerous out there, but I must be sure. I need to know. Let's do this. It's the outside, right? Or no, not yet, not yet. Okay, it's just out the slum area. Is it? Yeah, we're still in the dome or something. Look at all these zerk eggs. They will eat us. I can't do this. Take this badge. My papa will recognize it. He will know that you're a friend. Alright. <laughs> That's adorable. It's the face that goes. Oh! I'll open the door for you. Thank you. Well, thank God we're fast, aren't we? Okay, we're looking for Papa. Papa Doc. Papa Doc. Oh, we forgot to give music to... Morusk. Or... Is that his name? Look at how huge this wall is. Why are you barking, my love? Huh? Why are you barking? I remember it was a symbol of the division between those in the slums and in Midtown. That and the fact that they kept throwing their garbage down here. What a horrible thing to do! Maybe that's why they failed. Uh -uh. Right, because the robots followed like our economic uh, struggle class system. Thing. Did it. Oh no! Son of a bitch. Okay, 
catch me, can't catch me, can't catch me, can't catch me, can't catch me. Can't catch me, can't catch me, can't catch me, can't catch me. Maybe you can catch me. <laughs> oh no. No! 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 Okay, it's not that gruesome. Thank god. Oh, this looks like where my brothers and sisters are. No? Summit Greens. Get away. Get away from me. Nope, nope, nope. Get away from me. Okay. Shit. Haha. -ha. Safe. Look at us. Clever. That's nice. It's not strong enough. Okay. There we go. Love that puzzle. A oh, wait, wait, wait puzzle? Is that what it's called? Wait dead puzzle? I don't know. Oh my god! <laughs> Ouch! Are we okay? We look fine. We're strong. We love Enchanted Kingdom. Are you okay? That was a huge fall. Duck should be nearby. We must be close. How do you know? Oh, the tracker. Oh look, I'm injured. And then I'm fine. Oh, okay. Just gotta lick, lick our wounds. We gonna go. We gonna go. Yeah. So we're headed to the bougie robots. Bougie, bougie. Robots. Okay. Okay. I feel like there are more Zerks now. Yeah. Papa Doc, what this do? Oh, okay. It's an electric generator, but it seems to require some other part to function. Okay. So this way, follow the cord. No, I heard them. I heard them. Hello. Hello. Zerks. Uh, the cable. 
goes up this way. Got you. Okay. Goes in here. Oh. Hi. You will not be getting out. Oh, hey there. Whoa. Oh, Doc. Hey. It's you. I don't know what your voice should be. All you see here is wear costumes like this. They were small and running around, making lots of noise. Oh yes, I remember now. They were children. The streets felt much more alive with them. Even with the difficulty they brought, the adults seemed to love them very much. Doc says he was a Seamus. Is that the same thing? Quite possibly. <laughs> Seamus is his child. for the weapon is it is this is it this yeah it is hey be careful with that defluxer at full charge it can explode zergs like confetti this baby needs 1.21 gigawatts to work and the only thing around here with that kind of juice is the generator outside the house problem is that it won't start I think a fuse blew, and with all the jerks around, it's too dangerous for me to go out and fix. I'm not fast enough, but you just might be. If you can reach the generator and replace the fuse, I should be able to get the defluxer recharged. Come on, follow me. I'll show you what to do. Okay. A five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to fix the defluxer. By charging the generator outside. Bam, bam. Here, take this fuse. It's brand new. Turning on the generator will be loud, so expect some zerks. Once you fix the generator, it should be able to fracture. You just need to follow this cable, change the fuse, then meet me back here. Best of luck. Warmest regards. No worries. No worries. We can do it. Now, where would they come from? Also, maybe let's explore all the pathways. What if uh, we have to enter this street? Oh, look, we can't. Oh, we can, bitch. It's a faster route. Got you. But it's more sinewy. I feel like Zerks would come out there more. Are you ready? It's really cool. I love it. I'm, I'm, I'm coming. Hey. 
Good job. Good job, baby. Oh, he's just so happy. <laughs> Amazing, you got the generator back on. Have you seen how powerful the defluxer is? It's definitely your way out of here. Wait a minute, I might be able to mount this defluxer on your drone. <gasps> B12 is gonna be a combat drone. <laughs> it worked! The defluxer is now installed on your fancy drone there. It's not meant to run off such a small power source. If you use it too much, it could malfunction. Just remember, it's dangerous. Now let's go back to the village. I'm coming home, son. Yeah, motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How do we use it? This one? This button? Nope. Well, we got the UV lights. We're gonna, we're gonna bring you home, Pop. Don't you worry about it. <coughs> Lovely. <laughs>